Vinci. Am I strong? I gotta give it a go, yeah. I gotta grind, working for money in the door, yeah, yeah. Stop wasting time, you wasting your time for real. I'm about to no cap for real. Remember, we came from the dark for real. Yeah. Two, but they, they drown in the pool. Okay, I might need a boost. Okay, just give me the loot. Three or five, that's my city, the zoo. I'm on fire, someone call on the loop. On the five, I don't watch how you move. All my dogs, they gon' pull up and screw. Yeah, dummy, I don't get involved with the money. Why they got it tall, I didn't know me. Three, uh, I'm a ball like I'm Kobe. Two, he did it all with the homie. Indeed, shine bright like a sunny. Huh. Yeah, they don't love me. Huh. Yeah, I just think it's funny. Huh. Yeah. I'm a strong, I gotta give it a go. Yeah. I got a grind, working for money in the door. Are you broke and living paycheck to paycheck and only have a dollar and some change in your pocket and you need a cool outfit and some cool drip and even some shoes but can't afford it well i got some good news for you let's check out on my channel how i find neighboring items thrift store items cool shoes on a budget let's go Yo, this is Mars Blackman in the house with action photos. My main man, Michael Jordan. This is money slamming in Detroit, in Philly, Boston. Must be a bird's eye view. DC, LA, the yacht. Shut up, I'm doing a Nike commercial in here. Shut up. The other LA, Texas. Yeah. Denver, some serious hang time. Must be the mountain air. San Francisco, Moscow, Paris. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Walla Walla, Budapest, Sea of Tranquility. What's up everybody? So today I'm going to be doing a review on the Jordan Force Retro Fire Red. Bam! Here they are. The Jordan 4 Retro Fire Reds from DHgate.com. That's right. DHgate.com where they sell replicas and other fake shoes. So let's get into this review. So first off, I want to start off with the side here. As you can see, it has that air bubble that gives you that cushy uh, support on your foot. Also, it has the black and the red markings, just like the real one. Also, the mesh here, the mesh is kind of soft. As you can see, I'm pressing on it. I would say it's softer than the actual real ones, even though I don't have a pair of the original fours um i did look at some reviews on youtube of the real ones be before i decided you know to do this review so i would say the mesh is a little bit softer than the actual real ones so so the back side here it does say nike air there nike air and so the top part you know hear that mesh again softy mesh um, so I did swap out my shoestrings, the original shoestrings that came with these, um, because they were just way too long. So the original shoestrings that came with these are just way too long. And I'm like, no, I don't like, uh, you know, long shoestrings in my shoes. And so I, you know, had to get a smaller pair just because I like, you know, the shoestrings to poke out like this. So I think it looks better with the smaller pair. Um, it's whatever you like. So onto the tongue here, it has that flight there. Also, I would say the stitching on this is pretty bad. As you can see, the stitching is pretty bad. It's not really leveled, you know. It's it's like kind of um, not leveled, you know. But um, from far away, you know. I mean, who can tell? I mean, if you don't like the tongue, I recommend just wearing longer pants. But yeah, here's the tongue there. <coughs> so the inside review here, as you can see, is already starting to crease up a little bit. I only wore these one time and they are already starting to crease, all because these are not real leather. So they will crease up, you know, fast. But yeah, here's the inside there. Um, the white is, I would say white. I mean, this white and this white. This white is a little bit kind of like a creamy white, but this white is like really white. So this is like a white, I mean a creamy white, and then 
this is like a um a white white yeah white white so on the inside here it says Nike Air there I don't know if y'all can see it yeah it says Nike Air and the insole is red everything is red on the inside and here is on the tongue it says um it's upside down but it says Air Jordan on the back here and and again you know the stitching is kind of off so it's not my fault you know the stitching on there is kind of off but yeah here's the bottom it says Nike Air there and so I'm gonna give you guys a slow motion review as I slowly turn them around There's the tongue again, the ridges. Um, I would say these will pass. You know, I would say they will pass as the real ones. I mean, I mean, once I do the on foot review, you guys should get a better, um, you know, however you feel about them. I was, I mean, maybe I could change your mind about getting them, but I would say they will pass to me. They will pass. They will definitely pass in my book. I, I mean, unless someone is up close looking at them, I mean, they will pass for me. They will pass. But um, yeah. So I did, you know, get these from DH Gate. Um, also, I want to go over a few things. Well, first of all, these did not come with a box, so. Um, not all shoes from DHK come with the box because I don't know they just don't like boxes for some reason so um, if you want a box I recommend finding a seller on DHK that um, has the boxes advertised or else you'll be getting your shoes in like a plastic wrap wrap paper or like a bubble um, wrapper so on to some of the questions that you guys be asking me in the comments. First off, the um, how long does it take for the shoes to come? Shipping. So shipping, I would say now, the fact that the pandemic is still going on, shipping is taking about three weeks. So three weeks to get your shoes, you guys. So without the pandemic going on, it would be taking like two weeks max so so without the pandemic you know two weeks max now if you order shoes now it'll it's going to be like three weeks so three weeks now and also you guys keep asking me for the seller's name the seller's name is going to be in the description down below i'm going to put a link where you guys can find it and yeah so all those that be like Oh, what's the seller's name in the comments? Um, I'm going to put a link this time, not just the seller's name, but the whole link. So you just click on it and it'll take you straight to that seller's page on dhgate.com. And also I'm going to be putting the, um, the price and everything in the description down below. The price, the seller's name. Oh, also I do recommend getting a size up. I recommend getting a size up because China shoes do come smaller than the US so if you wear like a men's size 8 I recommend getting a 9 or uh, yeah if you're a woman I wear a size 7 and get an 8 so yeah I recommend getting a size up and um, yeah if you guys have any other questions for me I'll feel free to answer them in the comments so now I'm about to do a quick review on foot of these and I shall be back I just bought a new way spend a couple thousand just to cruise it Shawty said she love me but it's fresh and never prove it I never tell her but I put it in the music well that's okay all I want to do is make the best of my whole day thank the Lord up above get the cream on the side make you laugh to know it that's the stuff that I love la la da 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 we can be friends if you wanna We can just talk if you wanna We can all relax 
so that was the on foot review of the Jordan 4's Fire Red from dhgate.com. I hope I changed your mind about them, about getting these. Um, like I said, these pass for me. I mean, they look, you know, just like the real ones on foot to me. I would ju I would um, rate these an eight, uh, eight out of ten. And yeah, I hope you guys like the on foot review of these, and hopefully maybe you can hop on over to DH Gate and cop you some. Um, also, the real ones are going for like almost I think four hundred dollars. So um, these are like real cheaper. So you know I suggest these. You know I recommend these. Um, I showed you guys the review. I hope you like them. Let me know down in the comment section how you feel about these. And if it's something I missed and didn't um, talk about, let me know or if you have any questions. Um, thanks for watching this video today. Stay tuned for more videos coming out this week. Peace.